morning, well nearly afternoon actually, it's half past eleven, and um, we are on our way to the Potteries, Potteries Museum, I think that's what it's called. Um, we're having a, a, a very keep it local weekend aren't we Anne? Yeah. Um, tomorrow we're going to the um, Castle Artisan Market. We haven't been for a few, a few months. Um, and we haven't been for a few months for one reason or, or another. And the last one was actually October. We were away in November and then um, Covid and various guys who stopped us from getting there. The weather, you can probably hear actually in the background, the weather is absolutely appalling. Just look at this. It's like trying to, it's like that sleety, snow that's what we've got at the moment um, anyway we're heading into the heart of our city and we're going to be very cultural aren't we and <laughs> today and we will definitely catch up with you when we get there idea to do to bring the kids isn't it? We bought our kids when they were younger. Um, it's free to get in apart from one of the exhibitions. Is it the Titanic? It's the Titanic one. Yeah that's payable but everything else is free so if you want to kill an hour bring the kids, educate them um, and let's support our local heritage. It's so exciting. Um, it's in Hanley if you, if you don't know I'm sure you do. It's in Hanley. We parked on John Street um, just walking across the road and uh, it's dead easy to find isn't it? Yes. So we'll go in, explore, we'll take you with us and uh, yeah, enjoy! We went, so we supported the museum, and I was really interested in the ceramics. I feel like if you've been born and bred in Stoke on Trent, um, you most likely have a, an affinity with the pottery industry, don't you? Most likely. Um, so my nan was a patron, you know, at Royal Dalton. Um, anyway. So we are, oh and then we went for a coffee, that's what I was going to say, we also supported local didn't we? And we we bought a coffee and had um, a nice half an hour in the corner on Piccadilly. Now I'm not going to lie, I know the I know the corner because they have a Sharpay, dog puppy Sharpay, 
It was a latte, it was a large latte, wasn't it? And the two people, I've just paid £4.60 for that in a lovely environment in your local town, city service, sat there watching the world go by. If we'd have gone to Costa or Starbucks, what did you say to were about? I don't know, I don't shop in those places at all. Somebody told Andy that they are three quid, so that would have cost six pounds if you'd have sat in a Costa or a Starbucks. So um, that's it, isn't it? Takes clothes, really. Better, better value you get. It takes better quality, and you are putting money back into your local economy and helping local people provide jobs, pay their bills, etc., etc. Anyway, we're off now back home because Andy wants to watch what we play now. videos, planning, um, and like he's lucky, basically. Um, so keep your eyes peeled because we have got so many exciting things happening in the background, which we can't tell you about now, but um, all will become clear, I understand. So that's my plan this afternoon. And then tomorrow we'll take you along with us because we're going to... Castle Artisan. Yeah. If, well, even the training will go, won't we? We'll get wet. We'll, we'll, we'll swim in, as I said, in the morning. So we need to go, don't we? Um, so we're just going to call now and get some wine and beer. It's nice. And that's all. That's all we can. Anyway, we'll catch you guys later. Hello! It's a little bit later on, um, Saturday afternoon, I've left Andy at home watching the, the football and we've spied an opportunity, Jack and I have, to get out. Um, he's just there, I don't know whether you can, you can see him. So Jack and I are just out and I thought it would give me the opportunity to catch up. Um, and just explain maybe where we are with things. I know that we do a lot of these videos in the car. Um, it must be really boring, like watching us in a car journey. So at least you get a nice little bit of, um, I guess, scenery. Oh, I'm just going to show you these. Um, these swans, actually. Just hang on. I don't know whether you can see. Oh, I'm just going to try and... Um, I don't know whether you can see those little... Keep my eye on Jack. He's got a terrible recall as Jack. See what that looks like when it focuses. There we go. Look at those. So they are called Bonnie and Clyde. The mum and the dad are. I think, I forget how old they are. 20? Something like that. And they've had, I think they've got five. Five babies. Oh, they must be coming up to 12 months now. They have um, a new little clutch of a litter, a clutch, I don't know what they're called. <laughs> new, um, your new babies every year. Anyway, there we go. Back with you now. Back with you, back with you. Oh, I'm very good at this. This uh, multitasking. Um, Jack's drinking. Um, let me show you. Jack's drinking. 
he was drinking. He drinks that rainwater. Look at him. He loves it. He loves that fresh water. Sometimes he barks when it rains, after it's finished raining, to go out and just drink. So I've got Jack on the lead now. I can't cope with um, having to kind of multitask and talk and look for Jack. So he's safe here on the lead now with me. So yeah, I thought we'd catch up and just have uh, explained basically where we're up to. So if you watch us on YouTube, um, you need to visit our Instagram and follow us on Instagram. Our Instagram is keep underscore it underscore local 21. Um, and on our Instagram page, we post daily, look at this at the birds. We post daily, um, there's a little Robin. We post daily posts um, promoting and showing you local businesses, local things to do in the area. And most, at least six, six days a week we do that, at least sometimes seven if we've got the content, depending on what we've done and been up to. And we've also got some exciting things coming up for that Instagram page because we've, we've grown it quite quickly in a short space of time, which is so exciting. It just tells us that um, the community that we've built love seeing the posts, um, love to kind of follow and and help local business. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to change the hands of the lead. Just hang on a sec. <laughs> there we go. Love helping and promoting local businesses and local people. Um, so it's so exciting. So follow us on Instagram. So it means you can keep up to date with everything that's that's going on across Staffordshire, Cheshire and Shropshire. If we hear about it, then so do you. And if you enjoy these videos on YouTube, I think they're getting better. Let us know in the comments down below what you think. I think the quality is getting a little bit better. Andy's better than me at um, filming, definitely. But uh, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Um, if, um, Jack, <laughs> if you like these videos and you think they're getting better, then um, please comment and like them and don't forget to subscribe we have people watching our videos that haven't yet subscribed oh and that's completely fine that's completely fine um, but um, it would be really lovely to get our subscriber numbers up I think I've explained before my understanding is and again I'm no expert but the more subscribers that you have um, the more likelihood YouTube will recommend our videos to other people and then we get to grow our channel our community and we get to grow um, hopefully and promote our local area to people outside of the area to get people into our area spending money um, so yeah that's all I've got to say really I just wanted to, to maybe have five minutes while um, I was out with Jack um, so yeah, we'll crack on with our walk, won't we, Jack? And you are with us all weekend. So we will see you probably, um, probably tomorrow, maybe later. Catch you then. I just thought I'd show this specifically for my sister who lives in Dubai, who walks her, um, she's got two American Bull Terriers and she's got a pug and she's lucky enough to be able to walk her dogs like in the desert. And um, this is just for you. Like, look at this. This is what we're contending with right now. Slipping all over the place. Good morning. Hello. Hello, it's Sunday. It's awful, isn't it? To be honest, we're off to Castle Artisan this morning, as we said yesterday. And I didn't know where the route would be on. Do you think I'm? So we're just, we've got our oat cakes, look, and Dizzy Tears there, sausage and cheese, I've got mine here, cheese and mushroom, and we've showed this before, but we're just on Station Street, and behind us is Longport Station, we just pulled over to eat them, and just down there, just see if I can, I can show you there, 
<laughs> that's oat bakers um so highly 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 recommended the best oat cakes aren't they mm, yeah. really nice okay we'll get on with our day we'll eat these and then we'll, we'll get on We braved it, didn't we, Anne? We did brave the yeah. storm. Well, worth it because we've met some wonderful um, businesses, haven't we? Mm. Today, I think, I think there's two or three, two businesses that haven't been at this market before, haven't traded at this market. So it's lovely to meet them. Mm. And yes. you need to follow us on Instagram if you're watching this on YouTube. You need to follow us on Instagram so that you can see our updates. Um, of these businesses that we meet and we tag and promote, don't we, And Yeah, we do. Um, are we going to get run over? Possibly, we're walking on a road. <laughs> I thought this was pedestrian. Pedestrian. Pedestrian eyes. Anyway, so, um, so yeah, we've just had a walk through Newcastle to Queen's Gardens and we're heading back towards the market. We'll have another little loop round, won't we, And? We will. Hmm. And, um, yeah, we hope that you've enjoyed this video don't we we do we do and we'll catch you guys on the next one see, see you, you later